Representative John Mizuno says he will revive the proposal after last week's double murder suicide. They were shot and killed in their Makiki home early Friday morning. Police believe Claiborne Conley killed them before taking his own life. It happened just hours after Cass reportedly told a friend she was thinking of filing a temporary restraining order against Conley. Representative John Mizuno believes an electronic TRO filing system may help avert more tragedies like this. The key is that it would have been another option for our police officers to use, as well as our victims of domestic violence. Mizuno will reintroduce a bill that establishes a three-year pilot project across the state that would allow domestic violence victims to request protective orders online seven days a week. Mizuno wrote and introduced a similar bill last legislative session, but it failed because of concerns over cost and infrastructure. We would need to have outstanding connectivity with all the computer systems. That would include all counties, police, and the judiciary. Meanwhile, we are learning more about Conley. Court documents reveal under Cass on Wednesday evening at the state capitol. And if you'd like more information on Mizuno's ETRO proposal and exactly how that will work, go to our website at KITV.com. Paula? All right, thank you very much, Jody.